The issue of the incinerator at Javelin Park has reached a critical juncture. One that uh, I find particularly disappointing because the Secretary of State Eric Pickles has yet again put off the decision which I would like to believe is a refusal of uh, the County Council's attempt to impose an incinerator at Javelin Park. Now it's all well and good him saying he can't take a decision because of new evidence and because of the way in which this is such an important issue but that just leaves us in a state of limbo. He should be rejecting this incinerator application now and he should be making it clear that this is the wrong technology at the wrong time and on the wrong site. I've long called for the need for an independent investigation of the way in which the County Council has now got into this pickle, sorry about the pun there, but has got into this terrible situation where it's acquired a site which uh, it did allege at the time it was technology neutral, where we all knew it was going to push an incinerator. It's been through a full planning appeal and what we really want to know is what's the basis of the contract it assigned uh, with UBB. Uh, it's important to know why it signed the contract at the stage it did do, tie in its hands when there were alternatives, there were better ways in which we could get rid of our waste. So it's all well and good people now saying that uh, uh, we have to wait and uh, we have to get the right decision. We know what the right decision is. The right decision is to abandon this dreadful incinerator uh, uh, technology and to find out why the County Council did what it did both on the site and in terms of the contract. When we got that uh, sorted then we can move forward and I'm pleased to say that Stroud District Council, which I'm a member, did play its part at the appeal showing that there were better ways in which we could get rid of our waste and hopefully all people can get behind that now and make sure that this uh, really hideous decision is one that can now be turned on its head and let's move forward and get a decent uh, waste uh, removal system in place in Gloucestershire rather than what has happened at the moment.